Hello, people. It is with me, aka CK, aka Chocolate Kisses. And I know I look crazy, but I'm attempting to put curls in my hair using this uh, yarn method that I've seen on YouTube. I can't remember who did it, but there's someone out there. Um, but yeah, this is what it looks like. This is rough. I don't, I don't care about getting things too perfect. As long as I have a good end result. So I'll show you how I did this. I have my piece of yarn. And you bend it over. Okay, make sure you got a little loop. Section out the hair. Take the loop and feed the thread into it. The, the yarn into each other like that. Make it tight. And then what you want to do is loosely wrap it around. You don't want to do it too tight. And mine are so long that I stop halfway and pull it up. And then keep going down loosely. And pull it up. And down. Loosely. And when there's it's pointless to keep pulling it up and you know the edges is I mean the the ends are you're at the end, just wrap the rest of it around like that. Just wrap it. You don't want to tie it in that because you have to get this off after you either dip it or steam it. I'm going to steam it because I just don't want to be all wet. Like if I dip it in hot water and that it's dangerous. Okay, you see that? Oh, that's kind of perfect. Alright, I'll show you one more time. Fold over your yarn. Make sure you got the loop. Take the yarn around it and feed it through. Tighten it. Then loosely do it around, around, around. And then pull up. And round, around. What you're doing is you're holding the, the yarn and you're pushing the yarn braids up while you pull the yarn down. Steamer one, get bubbling away. I bet if I did this neater, I could probably wear this as a style. If I did the, this in with black yarn, but you know, the only reason I'm curling it because I've had these in for about almost four weeks, and I'm sick of them. So I'm gonna get one more style out of it, and then I'm gonna take them out. These are sewing yarn braids. So you can do other things with your sewing yarn braids. Where's the back? Alright. I had took one track out. Because I was going to take it out. Then I decided, no. I'll keep it in. And see what this is going to look like. Alright. So I got my steamer. Letting it rev up here. What you're going to do is. You're going to take one of those. Big dookie rolls or whatever. I'm doing mine with the steamer. At this point, if you wanted to dip it in hot water, you could do that. That'll be quicker. But you'll have to wait for your hair to dry. And I don't feel like doing all that. So. Use my steamer. This is uh, my little steamer. I got it off of Amazon. It was like 10 bucks or something. So what you're going to do is. You're going to steam it all around. I'm 
I'm having technical difficulties with my steamer, but we're going to still get this done. All right. I'm doing is just twisting it around, getting that steam on on it. Okay, I'm going to do the rest of those and I will be right back. Hello people, I'm back. And I, for the sake of time, I already took the one, some in the back out. I'm going to show you guys these ones. I'm going to take these out real fast and all you got to do is just unravel this. And slide it down. I just go up here at the top and just pull this blue string. From the top, and then take that part off. Ooh, very nice. Um, I'm thinking you'd probably get a more crisper curl if you dumped it, if you dipped it, but I'm not doing all that because I don't want to burn myself. Okay. Try to do this real fast before my battery runs out. Oh yeah. A few things about the genie locks. They are sewing genie locks. Uh, means they're on the weft. That means this is a half sewing. Well, 25% of it is braids. The rest of it is a sewing of wefted genie locks. And they can be washed, reused. You can get them in any length, any color. Um, as you can see, you can curl them. Style them, put them up in the up to you. All that. Alright, here we go. Let me jig it around a little bit. What do you think? Here we go. These are my wefted sewing genie locks curled with yarn. I got this method from someone else on YouTube, tried it out, and it worked great. Here's the back. These are 30 inches in my shop. Go ahead and check out my shop, Etsy.com backslash shop backslash chocolate dip, C-H-O-C-L-E-T-D-I-P. Peace out.